So I think for all adults, they want to be able to have choices. They want to be able to do things that are important to them. And so for a person with autism to have the opportunity to have a job, to be able to live with peers if that's what they want to do, to be able to make decisions about what they would like for dinner, what, where they want to go, what movie they want to see. That's really important, and I think that the more that we can support people so that they can do that, the better that they'll be and the better that our society will be. We know that one in 68 children are diagnosed with autism, and those children become adults. And over the next 10 years, over 500,000 young adults with autism will become adults with autism. And we as a society are not well prepared for this increase in those with autism becoming members of our community. They need a place to work. They need a place to be educated. If they continue on to post-secondary work. They need a place to live and to be a part of our community. We need to make that happen. So in a university setting, it's almost like a microcosm of an entire community. So when I think about that, I think about the ability to go to a cafeteria, the ability to go to a bookstore, to be work in any of those places, to be able to work in a lab if that's what you're interested in. But also it provides a place to live and it provides recreation, whether it's a gym or the movies or clubs. And that's sort of built into a university that's so important to many of our young adults, whether they have autism or not. We have a wonderful opportunity as you think about a university environment for students who are so interested and passionate in helping people and working with people with autism to have the opportunity to get hands-on ability to support that person, understand what works, what doesn't work, and also, as we know, each person with autism is so different, but those students would really be able to apply what they've learned to each individual person. And I think that that's invaluable for both the student as well as the person with autism. So we know from families that there are not enough supports in place for people to be able to achieve the things that they want to achieve. The goal of being able to work, the goal of being able to take a class at a university, or the goal of being able to live as independently as possible. And so it's important that we have more providers and more people who can really support those with autism so that they can achieve what is really everyone's right to do. Everyone has the right to make choices and we need to support people so they can make those choices.